I am hereby officially calling the uh, Board of Finance Committee meeting in order. Um, today is December, Monday, December 18th. The time is 11.50. What's that? Yep. Yeah. I think he's okay. Thank you, Kevin. Thanks, Kevin. And I'm going to go ahead and turn this over to our treasurer. Perfect. Ms. Treasurer. Yes, thank you. Um, so we wanted to meet today regarding um, maybe potentially investing additional funds. Um, I brought to you today three rates um, that we could go over. Um, starting with First Federal, they have a two-year um, certificate at 4.80%. Via, they have one for 15 months at 4.5%, or we have our Trust Indiana, which is the completely liquid account. We can move our money whenever we would like. 5.3938%. Um, um, I know we had discussed potentially investing additional funds. We really haven't set an amount, um, which leads me to my next um, and piece of information. Our current operating account right now sits at $32,723,826. Our interest rate on that operating account is 4.03%. Um, with the initial $15 million that we invested uh, into the trust account, we have currently brought in $561,075.57. So my recommendation is to move um, some funds out of our operational account into a second investment account, um, kind of like a ladder effect. That way, if we want to transfer that original $15 million back over, we can. We can leave it where it's at. Um, I would just like to know, at this point, your thoughts on um, how much to transfer over from the operating account into an additional sub account. So if I'm understanding right, the so first federal and via mm -hmm. um, those are those are set terms. Yeah, they don't have <coughs> liquid, so right. you have to have set terms, and yeah. those were the best rate for those fixed term rates. Gotcha, gotcha. <coughs> but, so, but the other is even higher. The other one's even yeah. even yeah, higher. I mean, it's like it's even higher. It's kind of a no-brainer, right? Yeah. Yeah, and, and I just I, I love the idea that she can get to the money whenever I do too. she needs it. We don't have to pay a penalty or anything like that to get it out. So, um, yeah, so to me, it's a no-brainer as to what we do or where we put the money. It's just a question of how much. How much? Yeah. yeah what, what Mr. Barsley, you got any idea towards that or not? My my greatest uh, concern and and desire is to to. Make sure we have a main uh, maintain an operating balance, um, so that bills can be paid. And if if we have a a nice uh, buffer zone that we if we can sweep another ten million, I I don't know what you know the the treasurer would would uh, recommend. But if if we could sweep another ten or so million over and keep drawing that uh, five point three. I, I would say it's it's a no-brainer. Yeah. Well, I I had a thought that you might want to to be in at that ten million. So I will tell you in my other trust account that we use for our excise B and B funds that are transferred in from the state, I leave that money in there because the interest rate is so good. So I don't transfer that over to the operational account. Right now, in that account, we have um, seven million three hundred thousand. So, if you'd like, I can take five million from that account and then five million from the operational account, which gives us the ten. So, you still don't have to worry about the operational account um, being underfunded by any means, so and then that gives you an, you know, best of both. Yeah, so the operational account is sitting at what again? It's sitting at 32, 32. Um, 723,000. What, what do you come, what, what are, what's your what comfort level as far as like I'm what that balance looks like? What, what does that balance need to be? So typically after our fall settlement, that operational account drops down. So we see anywhere from 17 
to roughly 25 million on average. So it'll take five so more out. I think we would be okay. So if you want to do another 15 million, absolutely. I wouldn't be concerned at all. I would like, I'd like to do as much as possible. I do too. I, I would like to I mean, do. we're making that kind of money. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that 5.39, that's a, that's a very money. good rate. It's completely liquid. Um, and that changes and daily yeah. for them, right? Yes. And that's, yeah. that's the difference, right? Because we'd be locking you. in the 4.8, things like right. that. But I love the yeah. liquidity yep. that if we need yeah. to do something, yeah. right? Right, yep. I mean, you're the finance guy. No, that's, the, that's the big thing with me is, yeah. is, is if we, let's just say we went with First Federal, who was 4.8, and, we, and mm -hmm. we put $10 million in, into that. Um, that ten million is locked in for the term, and I don't, I can't remember what Tiffany said, but that's that's pretty much locked in. And then, if something happened two years. for two years, yeah, see. yeah, and if we needed to get to it, we'd take a substantial yeah. penalty. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah. And if we get to a situation where you don't feel comfortable with what's an operational account, I you can, can always move that. You can move it out. Yeah, yes. twenty-four hours. Yes. Yes. I, I guess what I would recommend is that we move over into into the second account as much as she feels that we're that we're comfort that the comfort level that you that you would have. I don't know if that's ten million, fifteen million. I'd like to I'd like to put as much as we possibly could in there. Are you um, good with why don't 15? we just do yeah. it not to exceed fifteen? Yeah. That's, yeah. Okay. I'd make that a motion if you need it, sir. So we have a so we have a motion from commissioners Commissioner Bardsley to move uh, no more than 15 million over into the second fund that our treasurer has been talking to us about. And I'll um, second that. So we have a motion from Commissioner Bardsley. We have a second from Mr. Wright. Is there any other questions or comments? So hearing none, I will ask for a uh, I'll ask for a vote. All those in favor, signify by saying aye, please. Aye. 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 Motion Via WebEx. <laughs> Via WebEx. Motion carried. Good. Ms. Treasurer, do you have anything else that you feel like you need to pass on or talk about or let us know? No, not at this time. Okay. I, like I said, I didn't want to take up much of your time. So, short, sweet, and simple. Yeah. Thanks so much well, for all you're doing. Yeah, on this. big money. Yeah. I mean, 500 and some odd thousand, is that what you said? Yeah. That's, um, a, that's a difference maker. That's, that's a big yeah. difference maker. Oh, and here we go again, right? And we only put ten million in the first. We batch. put fifteen. Did we put fifteen? So we're doing fifteen again. Yeah. So that's yeah. the kind of numbers possible here that we can see. Up. I mean, that's some serious cash. Mm -hmm. yeah. like I Thanks, said, Tiffany. You're you're so welcome. Yeah. To letter it out, it makes it a little bit more um, enjoyable that way. Yeah. If we do need to transfer some of that money out, we can. No yeah. problem. Yeah. But I don't foresee us needing to do that, especially yeah. going into the spring. Okay. Good. So. Good. All right. Well, I will get that taken. Today. All right, perfect. Thank you. You are so welcome. Uh, gentlemen, anything else for the good of the order? I think that's it. If not, I'm going to call this uh, meeting into recess. Perfect. We're done. Thank you.